Hey, welcome back to Suzy's Scrap and Spot. In my video tutorial today, I'm going to show you how to download SVG files into your computer to use with your Sure Cuts a Lot program. Now remember, an SVG file is an image that somebody has already traced, saved as an SVG, and now it's compatible with your Sure Cuts a Lot program. So all you have to do is import it, put it on your mat, and hit cut, and it'll cut. Okay, so today we're on a site called Free SVG Files. They have a whole bunch of files. A lot of them are linked out to other websites. On the left here, you'll see all the different categories. Today, we're going to go with bugs. So if I click on bugs, this is the screen that's going to come up. And to the left of the file, you, you will see the images that will actually be cut by your Cricut if you choose that file. Today we're going to work with these ladybugs, and so if I were to click on the ladybugs, this is the next screen that comes up, and right under it, it says, this is by Brittany's SVG files, and you would click right here to go straight to her website to get the SVG file. So if we click on that, it's going to bring up her site, and right below the ladybugs, you'll see click here to download. So you click there and it's going to take you to a free file sharing website. Now you don't have to sign up for these. Um, they're free and I'll show you what what will happen on the next screen. Download now, no virus is detected. So you click on download now and it would take you to this screen. And right here it would say, since you're not a premium member, you have to wait 10 seconds before you can download this. Not that big a deal. I just don't want to sign up and have to pay for something that I can get for free. So then I would hit click here to download this file. And once I do that, I'm not going to click it because when I do it makes a horrible sound and I don't want you to have to hear that. When I do, I'm going to get that um, little screen that comes up that says open or save. And I'm going to click save and then it's going to bring up this screen and ask me where do I want to save it to. Well, all of my SVGs are under documents, my documents, and under Cricut right here. So I would open that up and it will some of them will be in compressed format some of them will be just as an SVG file it's up to you what you want to do with them when they are in a compressed format I will put it in my free SVGs because then I know I have to unzip all the files that are in there if it is just an SVG file I will take it right into whatever category I want and click Save and then it's there and I've already downloaded the ladybug right here. It's there ready to go. So when I open Sure Cuts a lot, I can import it and cut it immediately. And I will show you how to import the SVGs in another tutorial. But that's all there is to downloading SVG files. Pretty quick and simple. Come back and see us for another tutorial. Thanks for stopping by.